Hello everyone. Welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to use Mathematica in order to calculate the eigenvalues and eigenvectors of a, any matrix. So, uh, one way, uh, okay, but before calculating the eigenvalues and eigenvectors of a matrix, let me tell you uh, a very common way that we use to calculate the eigenvalues and, and eigenvectors of a matrix by hand. So, if I define any matrix let's say this is a matrix so this matrix is equal to to define a matrix in mathematica first of all i will write these curly brackets so then i'm going to write the first row of a matrix let's say the first row of a matrix is one and two and then the second row of the matrix separated with the comma and then written in these brackets so let's say this is minus six and one so this is my matrix in Mathematica if I want to write this matrix in the matrix form so I will simply write this mat double slash and matrix form it will give me the matrix form of this matrix the usual way to calculate the eigenvalues and eigenvectors of a matrix is so what we do normally so I'm going to convert this to the text. So we take this determinant of matrix minus lambda. So we take this as let's say lambda is any eigenvalue or here I will write this just L and then the identity matrix. So instead of writing this L, let me write this P. So P is the eigenvalues and I is the identity matrix. So for this matrix, the identity matrix can be a two by two matrix. So let me come to Mathematica that how can we calculate eigenvalues and eigenvectors for this uh, matrix. So for the eigenvalues, uh, let's write EV stands for the eigenvalues, which is equal to so in Mathematica, there is again a built-in function. I will write this eigenvalues. So here we will write this eigenvalues of this matrix. So since it is a two by two matrix, it will give us two eigenvalues. So the first one is separate with the plus and then the second one is negative and these both eigenvalues are imaginary eigenvalues. So for the eigenvectors, E eigenvectors is equal to, I will write such as eigenvectors and then we will write this mat so it will give us two eigenvectors of this matrix so further you can write these eigenvectors in the form of matrix form so it will give the matrix form of these eigenvectors so these are the two ways uh, this this is the single way that you can calculate the eigenvalues and eigenvectors of a matrix so let's say if you don't want to calculate the eigenvalues and eigenvectors separately and we want to calculate the eigenvalues and eigenvectors of this matrix simultaneously then we have an, another command which is so called eigen system eigen system and then this matrix shift enter you will see so uh, so the first numbers in this curly bracket these shows the eigenvalues of this matrix and then these are the corresponding eigenvectors of the matrix so the first eigenvalue correspond to the first eigenvector and then the second eigenvalue correspond to the second eigenvector r you can say that the first eigenvector corresponds to the first eigenvalue and then for the second eigenvalue there is a second eigenvector if you like my video do subscribe my channel thank you so much Goodbye.